Hello, my lovelies, and welcome to another episode on the Truly Bedrock server. That's right, guys. We are back, and we are ready for today's episode. Today, guys, we have a pretty fun episode because it is time for the next Truly Bedrock competition in order to get the Truly Trophy, and I am teaming up with one Mr. Foxy no -tails. In fact, I should be meeting him in a few seconds, so uh, let's just jump right into it. Miss B. Yes. <laughs> it's me. It's that fox fella. Are I'm, you sure? I'm Hmm. Yes. We're yeah. doing competitions. Many, many. Yes. Yes. I've got <laughs> presents for you, by the way. Uh, we'll We'll talk about these ones in a minute. I've got okay. some presents because, okay. you know, we're, we're doing ancient debris mining. It's probably going to be quite dangerous. So we, we've got sharesies on there. <laughs> okay. I will gladly take a few of those. Thank you. So I've already, already actually done one of these with slack because i'm i'm being cheeky and being two teams <laughs> so what's your strategy going to be so for our team i was thinking that the best plan of action is probably to obviously tnt mine we could bed mine but that's just messy and if yeah. we're going for efficiency i think tnt tunneling out very very much far and just blowing everything up and so as I, I was thinking, right, some teams will probably stay together, like, completely, and other teams will, like, just completely go apart. I think if we go to the same area but maybe head in different directions, we will uh, be able to to maximize yeah. our debris getting. So you tunnel one way, I'll tunnel mm -hmm. the other. Are we both doing it lower down at, like, Y11, or are we going to go different Y heights as well, or...? Uh, I typically go at Y13. I find that I get the most return okay. that way so you're an experienced uh ancient <laughs> degree blower up uh, interesting this is good this is good news now you brought me a sugar box full of sand i brought you a sugar box full of gunpowder and yes. with that then we can make hopefully many many tnts i, I think be good. that this will probably make like a stack <laughs> I've, I've i don't know yeah that, mm. Mm. But I've got three stacks on me. I how much? How much? That gave yeah. me two. All right, but I I've have three, three and a half. I've got. I have Is that, that all of the gunpowder. Yeah. Oh, look at that. We oh, got wait. loads. There we go. So here, I had an extra stack. If you had any extra sand. <laughs> yep. There we go. We've got another nineteen TNT. So there we go. Look, we've got like nearly ten stacks of TNT. Okay. That's going to get us going. Yeah. That's going to be great. Yeah. Okay. okay, so we've got half an hour that we have to put on the clock. That doesn't include getting there and getting, yeah. you know, a little home area set up. So if we get over to an area and then we'll just, you know, hit the go button and, and dig mini, mini. Mini, mini. I like mini, this mini. plan. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Yes. Where are we going? 700. And you'll be going to minus 500. Oh, yeah, yeah. And that. then stop and turn around and go. Yeah. Sounds good to me. Although. All right, then. I'm going to. We, head up. We need to set a timer. Yes. Hold on. Meh. I'm on it. There. I've got one. You have a timer? Yeah, I did. Yeah, nearly. Yeah. Almost. <laughs> yeah, there we go. We've got a timer. Okay. Tell me when you're ready. And I'm ready now. Go. Let's do Oh, jeez. Oh, it's a bad start. It's a bad... There <laughs> oh, we go. Oh, I fell in a hole. <laughs> yeah. Don't... Oh, jeez. Oh, no. No. Oh. Oh dear, I'm, yeah, fire resistance already, please. I'll, I'll, <laughs> Don't die straight away. I that love would, the nether. You know. That's brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> it's my favourite place to be. Um, I'm two stacks in. And I'm almost back. Yep, okay. see, back. <laughs> All right, we have, we've gone nine, we've been nine minutes, which we're doing well, I think. Yeah, so, I think so too. Are you going to start yours off? Yep. I... Okay. Oh, there we go. Doing the same. Oh, oh, Many oh. bangs. There we go. Ooh. Yes. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. Okay. This is where I need lots of fire resistance. Yep. I, <laughs> I was literally just doing the same thing. And all right. Nothing in the first chamber. 
Oh, got one in mine. All right. Oh, that was silly. I just, <laughs> just lit that TNT with nowhere to go. <laughs> Smart. Ha, ah, a couple here. Excellent. Wow. Yes. I'm going to be rich, Jesse B. I think so. Well, these these explosions are certainly not as impressive as when you do them uh, in a chain. Yeah. Like one after the other. Ooh, <laughs> you get one. big holes when you do that. So that was a lot of fun and it was a long day with Foxy. So here we are back at the base and I decided that while we wait until we get the results of the contest that we will start working on our storage room for our mob farm. So I didn't like just there being a platform up there. And I had made the platform, and I don't know if you guys had actually seen it in a video, but I just was like, okay, I'll have a platform there so I can get to the chests, no big deal. But no, <laughs> we can't have a base with just a random platform and no actual structure. So we're gonna do this. So <laughs> we're just gonna build this up using the same blocks from around our base. I thought we would use some bone blocks, um, probably black stone, and maybe the warped wart. Instead of the warped uh, bark block, doing this is probably a little bit easier. And also I think we'll still look just as good. I mean, yeah, I think it'll look just as good. <laughs> but while I'm doing just random building, I thought, you know what, let's have a little chat. I don't have to sit here and be like, and now we're using more bone blocks. And now we're doing this. <laughs> so if you guys don't like this process of how I'm going to do it, let me know. But I thought that I would keep some of these builds on camera and just kind of use this as an opportunity to talk. Does that make sense? But I won't ramble. So <laughs> what I wanted to talk about was actually the debris mining. So you are only seeing clips from one <laughs> of the attempts that Foxy and I did. We actually did three <laughs> and it was a lot of fun hanging out with the Fox man. It, it was a blast. But I thought, you know what, I'm not going to put all three of those in one video. It just didn't make any sense. As I was like looking back at the clips, I just realized it's the same thing. It's so repetitive. So we're just going to go ahead and show you that little montage that I did. And then I will just tell you what happened because it's actually quite interesting. So we did three takes. We did three takes in three different methods, and each of them turned out pretty much the same. We had 96 one go, we had 99 another go, and then we had 106, I believe, or 108, I can't remember. But that's so similar. That's about a stack and a half for each time. So I don't think it actually matters what method that you use. We got about the same every time. So of course there was, you know, give or take a few, but I found that really interesting because we did the 
uh, TNT method. Uh, we did just regular mining. And yeah, it, t it turned out really similar. And it turns out that other people who did something similar, I think Slack and Foxy also did it, and they came up with a similar number. And they had used end crystals, I think. So yeah, I, I found that pretty entertaining. So I would like you guys to go try just because I'm interested. I'm curious. I would like to know how many ancient debris do you guys find in 30 minutes in whatever form you guys choose to. I just want to know how many you get because I'm willing to bet it's pretty similar to what we got. <laughs> and I will say I really had such a good time with Foxy. It made me realize I want to do more collabs. It's really kind of difficult for me because my recording schedule is so different and difficult for the other members because I have a baby. So I don't get a very average time to record. I get probably three or four hours and and that's it like that's my window it's a very tight window but if I could collab with anybody like soon who would you guys want me to collab with I I would like to know what you guys would like to see because so far I have collabed with uh Foxy and Tiz I think that's it, really. I mean, I did a few things with Lee, and we did the end rating with Beardy, but really we didn't, like, do a crazy collab. So if you guys would like to see me meet up with anybody, let me know, because I will try to make it work, because that was a lot of fun, and I would like to do more of that. I would like to hang out with the other TB members, because I genuinely like them all. <laughs> But as you can see right now, I'm kind of just making this water elevator. I I don't know if I exactly like the look, but we're going to keep playing with it. Maybe it'll turn out good <laughs> and I'll be pleasantly surprised. But yeah, I, yeah, I think I'm going to play with this and I'll come back when... I have more of an idea of what I'm doing when this is a little more structured, maybe. All right, so I've added in the water tower and this is, I think, gonna look okay. Let's see, let's put this here. Ha ha, let there be water. <laughs> okay, um, uh, I'm not sure if I wanna just bring this all the way down down. You know what? Well, we'll try. Hold on. Let's get up here. Um, can I, uh, I'll place it on the side. Okay. So let's do this and then just hop all the way up and then we'll have to put a button at the bottom with just a piece of water. And I think that will probably be sufficient. Um, okay. Excuse me. There we go. All right. Put, hello? Oh, okay. And there. So I think I like that just fine. It's, look, it looks okay. <laughs> I'm still not completely sold if you cannot tell. There's, I don't know. It just seems really plain. But I think what I want to do do now is it's about time to meet up with the other TB members and talk about who won the mining competition. Well, the netherite mining competition. And where did those bones come from? Okay. Anyway, yeah, I'm gonna go meet up with them and I will come back as soon as that's done. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> uh so, Where'd everybody go? <laughs> does anybody know where the trophy is? Um, I I don't think Tiz is giving it back, guys. Tiz, why did Tiz got the trophy? Because he hasn't died yet. Remember? Oh, yeah, man. We, we awarded it to him recently, and he said he's going to keep it forever. Yeah, so uh, that could be a problem. Great. So who won? Uh, 
pretty sure it was silent and beardy. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll put my right. suit on for it and everything. There's not even a trophy. pointless being here then. See you later, guys. Oh, oh, have okay. a nice day. Bye. Bye. Um, rude. Same time next week? We can try. Yeah, I guess so. I guess one of us needs to try and get the trophy from Tiz, right? I think that's your job, Beardy. I kind of get the feeling he's not going to let me near him. <laughs> well, I, I'm kind of—I have a feeling that's probably where Silent is right now. So. All right. So that was a bit of a mess. I'm not going to lie. Uh, we tried to meet up, as you saw, and well, it just didn't go very well. So here we are. Back at the collection system, and as you will notice, I have made a contraption. I decided that since this is where we make our fireworks, you know, gunpowder farm, I would put a uh, nano sugarcane farm. So it's the same one that I have at my chunk base. So just, you know, an observer clock and um, just a regular dispenser in with bone meal into sugar cane. So, I mean, super simple, nothing complicated. And I'm not going to show you all the inner workings again, because you guys have already seen it. So I'm just filling in this floor because I decided that blackstone would look better here than the, um, oh, what is it? Stone slabs. Uh, so I think this is probably a much better decision. I think that it looks better in general. And I think, I think I'm onto something here. I know it's early and that it still looks pretty janky, but I think I have an idea in my headspace and I think it's gonna come together. <laughs> but that just requires a little bit more detailing and maybe just a little more creativity. Right now, this is looking pretty bland, but with adding this uh, nano farm, I think that I, I like what I'm going with. I, I think that this was the right idea. I wasn't so sure about the bones and everything at first, but the more that I look at it, the more I think, yes. This will tie into my base below, but it will also be its own little thing. So yeah, I think we're going to stick with it and we're just going to continue these patterns down so that we can get a, a nice look, <laughs> like a nice polished, finished look. And I think I'm going to take inspiration from our storage room and kind of the hallways. So I'm going to add uh, bones here, right? Surround the chest and then maybe have those corner pieces that I have in the storage room. Not completely the same thing because I don't want to just do the same pattern over and over again, but I do want a pattern. So let's try to see how bone blocks, not bone blocks, blackstone looks over the chest. Let's see if that makes much of a impact. I'm thinking that that's probably the wrong decision. And what I should add is actually warp stairs because I don't like that. <laughs> that stands out in a not good way. And yeah, no, that's not staying for sure. That's not staying. See, I mean, a lot of this game is just trial and error, and there's nothing wrong with that. Uh, do I have any warped stuff on me? I don't, but you know what I do? Let's see. Oh, shouldn't let these despawn. That's not good. Okay. In my storage system, I should have what I need, hopefully. Uh... So let me go look and then maybe we can uh, fix that up. All right, so that was definitely the right call. <laughs> Adding the warp stair with the warp trap door, so much better. That it doesn't stick out like a sore thumb and I think that really ties that together. I'm not overly worried about it. I do need another hopper with another chest so that we can bring those chests down further. Uh, I have to figure out what to do for these walls. And 
for a system to get up to the top where the magma is. Just in case anything happens, I need a system to go up and down from there. So yeah. And in true Jesse fashion, <laughs> I've done some work. So I have added the black stone. I have added the chest. I have added the corner pieces. And I really like it so far. I think this is coming together. Oh, and uh, elevator. So yeah, I think this is good. I think that this serves the purpose and I'm really happy with it. I think overall it looks like it's going in the right direction. Yeah, so I can't complain too much, but I have gotten word that Silent is now available and so is Zloy. So we're gonna meet back up with them and we're going to officially figure out who won the Truly Trophy in the competition. And you know, that, that should be good. <laughs> so I will see you guys when we get to the others in just a second. Welcome one and all to the annual awards celebration thingy kind of ceremony where holy poop another one already it feels like just yesterday we were congratulating this Tom for surviving truly bedrock for so long which you know kind of an award all of us deserve and now <laughs> this little fella here will be coming with whoever has gotten the most amount of netherite or also known as what we call ancient debris, in a competition to get specifically that and find out the best method of actually getting it. Today, the secret to the ultimate netherite gathering will be revealed to all of us here today. I honestly have no idea who actually won. Not us. <laughs> it was us. Yeah, the, that part I know. You made it perfectly clear. Uh, <laughs> Silent Beauty, was it really you who, who won all of these things? Yeah, it we got 119 good. in one hour. Well, come, uh, come up here one hour. and uh, accept your cool... Or, sorry, 30 minutes. Sure, <laughs> <laughs> <Just, just> silence. <laughs> I was supposed to tell them. It's fine. Wait, are we sure this thing isn't trapped now? Hold on, I have little hope. Okay, yeah, that looks safe. Never mind, it's fine. Put it back, put it back. Oh. <laughs> Everything's fine. Everything's what? Fine. Whoa, 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 this was not planned for. We just had a trophy heist, everyone. <laughs> He's gone, guys. Sorry. I'm a, I'm a little bit disappointed. <laughs> we did, uh, dang it, this is what you get for trapping the stage, but it, having it not actually trapped. Well, oh, can we have one on ceremony without this? <laughs> okay, well, I'm just going to take the ancient debris that are like right here, so I guess well, that'll well, be well, our mine as well. This is not working out well. Why <laughs> can't I hear? I'm so catching up to him. Why did you even have a? Are you kidding me with this? Oh no! Oh, there we go. Well played. Well played. Oh. Wow. Oh, oh man. Can you get? Can you get my things, please? I'm oh. trying to, but you know the Jeez. best part. I had a full inventory. No one's chasing me. <laughs> oh come on, Sloy. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. Nice. There we go. Here's a nice new trophy for you. <laughs> okay. I guess. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> we're the best at netherite mining. You guys are terrible. Thanks. Yeah. Bye. That's that's all. I got. That's that's it. That's all it needs. Yeah. That, that tells the story. It's short and sweet and simple, right? The best by like yep. ten. I mean, that's not that great. It's, it's, it's a lot. Ten, ten better than better than you. Wow. Yeah. Like wow. Some teams. I mean, hey. I'm, 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 wow. I'm sorry. I instantly, I instantly feel really bad. <laughs> <laughs> I don't believe I'm him. I'm telling on you. <laughs> oh no. Oh, everyone else does. You might as well. <laughs> okay guys that was a bit of a hot mess i'm not gonna lie uh i i don't think you guys saw because i think i had actually stopped recording but i ended up following after zloy and foxy and silent and beardy and well some hijinks happened and maybe if i can get a clip from silent i'll show you that clip right here if not i'm just gonna tell you what happened if there's no clip 
then what happened was uh, Foxy was killed. Or, wait, Foxy was trying to kill Beardy. Silent accidentally killed Beardy. And then Silent killed Foxy. And, and, and then I killed Silent. <laughs> so, um, yeah, that happened. But, yeah, but mm, yeah. That, that's actually all the time I have for today. This episode has actually gone on a pretty long time. So without further ado, thank you so much for stopping by. I really appreciate you. I appreciate the time that you spend here. I appreciate the fact that you comment and you like and you subscribe. It means the world to me. If you would like to keep up with me in any other social media, I do have a Discord, a Twitter, a Patreon, and I think some other links down in the description below. And I am around all the time. So if you want to say hey, don't be afraid. I will talk to you guys. I love getting to know you guys. So thank you, thank you, thank you. I will see you guys in the next episode of Truly Bedrock. Bye, guys.